Tonight, Jackson County is mourning the sudden death of 48-year-old T.G. Harkrider. Harkrider served as the Public Information Officer and Director of Environmental Safety for the Florida Department of Health in Jackson County. As News 13's Emily McLeod tells us, county officials are remembering him by his kind spirit and caring nature. He's a good man. The Florida Department of Health and Jackson County's administrator, Sandy Martin, says T.G. Harkrider was a vital spoke in their wheel. He was a confidant. He took care of all of us. He was always the first to volunteer to do something for us. He was always the first to stand in the way when something, when something unpleasant was happening. T.G. was the first one to get in front of that and shield us. Harkrider died early Thursday morning. Martin says T.G. was a close friend of hers and almost like a counselor to everyone at the health department. We're a family here. We're a family at the health department. Teachy's a big part of this family, and we are heartbroken today. Martin says Harkrider was never too busy to help someone else. He was a true professional, and he was a, um, a true soldier. And um, I, like I say, I, I was honored to have known him. I was honored to have worked with him for as long as I did, and uh, we are so heartbroken. And we will pull together, and we will keep going, and we will honor him. Other county officials say Harkrider was a strong presence when guiding the county through a crisis. Um, no one will be able to replace that kind spirit, that sweet spirit that he had, and just that ability to make you feel um, listened to, heard. Officials also say they will always remember him being willing to go the extra mile. You know, he was always willing to help out. Uh, he was always willing to go the extra mile for whoever. It didn't matter if you worked for the county, you worked for the city, or any city, or even people outside of Jackson County. Martin says Harkrider will be remembered as someone who was always there for his team. In Jackson County, Emily McLeod, News 13, Panhandle Strong.